it had been a new year, a new start, a new adventure. I remember sitting there in the auditorium listening to explanation after explanation. All I hear was, this is the most difficult to get into, so consider yourself lucky. I remember back when my peers told me about being in it will make your life a living hell, seeing yourself shunned by reality and the outside world, everything done with. However, I knew I had made the right choice and I realized what was right. I had to be optimistic. It was my way of life. Seeing it in a positive point of view, added with smiles and laughs all around. But will I ever be ready to face the hardest thing that would come in my way in just a few days? I guess, yeah, I can. Apparently, I didn't. Day after day had become more difficult. Time was never my friend, sleep was never an option, relationships kept crashing down, and reality, well, reality just became blurry. I remember breaking down in the university toilet, tears of hatred, of dissatisfaction, of losing hope, faith, and finally, myself. I started skipping classes, made excuses, trying to run away from my responsibilities, but something had led me to keep fighting. My family, through their eyes, I want to make them proud, even if the accomplishment was little. I remember the feeling of envy seeing everyone else happy doing what they love and here I am putting on a plastic face while answering questions with an optimistic answer. It was time for change. I want to get it back. My spark. My own self. I just wanted to end it all. To make things back to the way they were. So I started again, slowly. I remember the feeling of sadness I encountered during that period will always, always be with me. I remember the words of my father saying that no matter what, I will always love you. It couldn't have gone any better since then. I managed to get out. It had changed me from a person I once hate and lastly to a person I once knew. Yet again, something stayed in. The traumatic experience. It had dominated me, making me weak when nothing was ever there to pull me up. But I never gave up. Today, everything's different. Thankfully, better.